Okay, this motor and this motor have a few differences between them, and we're gonna work our way towards making this motor, the one that came without wires, uh, more like this motor, the one that came with wires. All of the rest of the stuff that we're gonna do is to make it, make sure that this, the soldering, these bulbs that we just made don't break. The difference that we're gonna cover right now is there's tape on this one that's between uh, where the wires connect and this metal band. So I'm gonna put that same tape under here. And then later on, there's some hot glue that goes on top, but we'll do that later. Okay, so I'm gonna take about four inches or so of this tape, and I'm gonna use the wire cutters to cut it. The wire cutters uh, also have a little cutting section right there. So I'm gonna do this, and also just pull on it, and there, broke. Um, and now I'm going to uh, lift these wires up, but I don't want to break this, and I could break it if I lift them up too far or pull on them too much. Um, so I'm going to lift them up just enough to be able to slide the tape under. Uh, so here we go. Take that off. And I want to be really aware anytime I'm moving the wires that I'm also going to potentially move that part and bend it. So I'm bending it on purpose. Don't want to break it see if I can get so right now the sticky side is down towards the motor and I'm gonna get it under the wires and I'm also going to center it so now the center is on the motor directly and I'm gonna slide it as far towards those thing the little solder joints as I can before it ends up sticking and I can't slide it any further and then I'm gonna wrap one side around the motor uh, and as far as it'll go, and then I'll wrap the other side over the top of that. Everything looks pretty good. And then, now that I've done that, I will actually, I don't want to leave this these wires uh, vulnerable for too long, so I'm going to immediately get the uh, zip tie and put it around the motor and put it as cl around the circular part, but as close to the square part of the motor as I can. So it's gonna be right up against these little corners right here. And I want the zip tie to end up so that uh, the bulb is away from the wheel. If it's towards the wheel, then potentially the wheel could catch on it. Um, so that's bulb, it. Bulb, wheel. Uh, this is the wheel right here. This is this bulb. This is the bulb I was talking about. The part of the the latching part of the uh, zip tie. Does that make sense? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Cool.